Hello everyone. A warm welcome to everyone tuning in to the Oracle IAM Insights session today. My name is Will Ballantyne and I am part of the Product Management and Strategy team for the Identity and Access Management products. I will use the session today to provide you an overview of the Oracle Live Labs and then specifically dive into the IAM 12C workshop designed to provide you a complete integrated IAM 12C system that you can quickly and easily start for hands-on training demonstrations, detailed examination of features, and many other purposes. We will start by examining what Live Labs is, including how to access and use it. Then we will look at the IEM 12C workshop, now available in Live Labs. We will then see exactly how to access the IEM 12C workshop. And then finally we will do a quick demo of one way to use the IEM 12C workshop in Live Labs. So what is Oracle Live Labs? Oracle Live Labs is a freely available service provided by Oracle via the web so that people can try out Oracle tools and technologies. Oracle Live Labs gives you access to a vast array of Oracle's tools and technologies in a ready-to-run fashion with minimal effort. The Live Labs can be used for trying out features, verifying capabilities, rapid prototyping, without the overhead of creating a local environment and going through the process of installing and configuring all of the components. The content is provided via workshops that showcase specific tools, technologies, or combinations of integrated products. There are hundreds of workshops. The workshops are fantastic for trying out capabilities in a real environment, getting hands-on training, proof-of-concept construction, demonstrations, rapid prototyping, etc. The workshops guide you through the complex process from start to finish, providing an excellent learning path that includes hands-on examples to quickly understand and get a feel for how things can be made to work. Using Live Labs is quick and easy. First, connect your browser to the link provided. Alternatively, do a search for Oracle Live Labs and click on the link to Oracle Lab Labs. Next, click on the Available Workshops link in the Live Labs web page. Then click on the desired filters as needed to narrow down the workshops. Once the desired workshop is seen, click on the Launch button in that workshop. When launched, the workshops will show the different ways the workshop can be run. The workshops can be used in a free trial tenancy, an existing tenancy, or through a reservation of pre-built environments that are primed and ready to go. As can be seen, the workshop outline and some workshop details can be obtained directly from the launch page by clicking on the workshop outline and workshop details links. For Oracle Identity and Access Management, Live Labs provides access to the latest secure Oracle system built with 12C R2 and allows for multiple use cases and capabilities to be examined and tried out in great detail. The workshop is intended for architects so that they can examine and validate any aspect they need for an IAM solution design. Developers so that they can do any development they need using a real working system. Integrators so that they can try out and validate any integration aspect they need for integration in the target environment. Business users so that they can try out the tools and technologies to ensure that they work the way that will meet the business requirements and decision makers so that they can be assured that the tools and technologies work and are appropriate. There are many tools and technologies integrated in the Secure Oracle system used for the IAM 12C workshop. These are divided into three categories, identity governance, access management, and development tools and assets. Within identity governance, there is the OIG product itself. This is the in integrated with Oracle SOA suite BI Publisher, Oracle Unified Directory, Oracle Database, and a large number of OIG connectors, including connectors for the database. Within Access Management, there is OAM, OHS for the 12C WebGate, OUD, and Oracle Database. The development tools and assets include JDeveloper with SOA extensions, SQL Developer, Apache Studio 2, Apex, etc. A demo HR and IGA application that are integrated with the IAM 
of C Suite are also included. The workshop is organized into a series of labs. These labs include setting up the environment, initializing the environment, a sample HR application with employee lifecycle management, identity certification, and using RESTful APIs for both OIG and OAM. However, it's important to know that the system is not restricted to the documented labs. You can use the system in many other ways and explore the rich set of features and capabilities of the Oracle IAM's 12C suite. The system provided is perfect for trying out features and capabilities of integrated IAM, proof of concepts, validating capabilities while designing a solution, and demonstrating complex features in a live system. The available documentation is extensive and provides step-by-step -step instructions for getting started, step-by-step -step instructions for each of the labs, and there is also extensive product documentation available in the provided URL. Also, when the system is up and running, the browser available in the Secure Oracle system has bookmarks to all of the services reachable via a browser. Accessing the IAM 12C Live Labs workshops is the same as accessing other workshops. Namely, you connect to the Live Labs site, you click on Available Workshops. On the right side, scroll down to where it says Product, select Identity and Access Management, click Launch, select the way you want to run the workshop. Now we get to the fun part of this session. We will do a quick demo of the IAM 12C Live Labs workshop in action. For this demo, we will be connecting to Live Labs, finding the workshop, reserving the workshop, accessing the documentation, getting the IP address of the system that is created for us, connecting to the Secure Oracle system, starting the services, connecting to the OIG console, and connecting to the OAM console. Okay, so to get started, the first thing to do is to connect to the Oracle Live Labs website. As you can see, you can use your browser and just connect to this URL right here. Alternatively, you can just look it up on uh, Google, say, and uh, look for Oracle Live Labs and click on the link. To find the workshop, you click on Available Workshops, and then we scroll down until on the right side we see the products. And then we scroll down those until we find Identity and Access Management. And here you can see the workshop we're looking for, the IAM Suite 12C Secure Oracle Workshop. Then we click Launch. And the easiest way to do a quick demo is to simply reserve the workshop on Live Labs. So we'll do that here. And here you can see that uh, we can start the workshop now or choose a date. Um, we should uh, generally put in a public SSH key of ours so that we can access the workshop via SSH, but it is optional. And then we can, uh, we have to consent to receive the reservation emails. So these notify us when a reservation is being built, when it's uh, ready for use, and when it expires. Now, in order to do a quick demo, I've already submitted a reservation request. So I won't go through that. I'll just cancel from here. Once you receive the reservation uh, email, which usually takes about 10 minutes or so, then you can go and click on the link in the email or go to the Live Labs website and click on My Reservations. So here you can see I've got a reservation that is available. So then we can just launch the workshop. When we launch the workshop, you can see it provides all of the details associated with the tenancy and environment that have been set up for our reservation. And the important detail here, of course, is the IP address of the system that was created. So we'll just copy that. Now to see the detailed documentation for the workshop, we can actually go down to the bottom and you can see open the workshop instructions in a new tab. So if we do that, you can see that there are detailed documentation for each and every step and lab for the workshop. So things on how to set up different things, uh, how to initialize the environment. Now in our particular case, we can just uh, 
take a look at how we run the lab. So you can connect to the Guacamole service. So we'll just open up a new tab. We'll put in the IP address that we copied from the reservation details. And we put in the Guacamole URL. So as you can see, um, <clears throat> we essentially get a desktop that we can use to access the services. And then we can double click on the terminal. And then to start everything, we can say SC start all. Now this is of course all indicated here in the detailed instructions. So if you want to see how you start and stop, that's the command I just put in, SC start all. And in the interest of speed, I've already run that. And when it completes, you'll see that it will output uh, each of the services that it started for you and how long they took and so forth. So when they all succeed, then uh, you can immediately start accessing and using them. And of course, the easiest way to start using them is to open up the browser inside of the system. And all of the different consoles um, and ways to access the different sample applications and so forth have all been bookmarked for you. So if you want to, for example, access the OAM self-service console, you click on that bookmark. And in order to get the identities um, and passwords that you need for all of the different services, you just look at the detailed documentation and you can see here on step three, it tells you all of the different accounts that you need uh, and their passwords for all of the different services. So in this case, for identity, it's Celsius admin, Oracle 123. So we can just enter that. And you can see the uh, Oracle Identity Management Console is fully available and all of the different capabilities and features are all here. Similarly, we can access the Oracle Access Management Console. And again, the ID and passwords that you need are all available here. So if we scroll down, we'll see the OEM console is OEM admin. So we can just go in here. And uh, I had already authenticated before, so it remembers who I am. And you can see the full Oracle Access Management Console available and ready for you to try things out in, test out integrations, learn about all of the different features and capabilities. So this concludes the quick demo. Um, hopefully that was useful. Now let's go back to the presentation. I hope you found the session helpful and you're encouraged to check out the IAM12C Live Labs workshop yourselves. As you can see from the demo, it was quick and easy and uh, there's a wealth of capability right at your fingertips anytime you need it. Many additional workshops are in the works for IAM, including workshops demonstrating the deterministic upgrade process for going from 11G to 12C. Please tune in to the Oracle IAM Insights regularly and stay up to date on what is new and exciting in Oracle's IAM portfolio. Get tips to run your Oracle IAM infrastructure better and to listen to your peers' experiences with Oracle's IAM solution. Thank you again for tuning in to today's Oracle IAM Insights session. We look forward to seeing you at the next one soon.